यू नो वॉट फनी इन इंडिया एवरी स्कूटर इज अ स्कूटी एवरी लैडर फ्रेम कार इज अ जीप एवरी रॉयल एनफील्ड इज अ बुलेट जस्ट लाइक एवरी फोटो कॉपिंग मशीन इज अ जेरोक्स जस्ट लाइक दैट एवरी मोपेड इज अ लूना यू रिमेंबर द आइकॉनिक लूना फ्रॉम द काइनेटिक ग्रुप द हार्ट वीट ऑफ सो मेनी फैमिलीज एंड बिजनेस ओनर्स ऑफ इंडिया There was a time when Luna would sell around 2000 units a day making it the most popular moped on the streets of India. And you know back then it used to be priced at just 2000 rupees. Incredible, huh? Well, in what looks like a Bollywood comeback. Jeevan in ka raha na suna shaan se bole chal meri Luna. The Kinetic Group has announced the revival of this iconic moped legend but with a twist. The twist is that it's only going to be offered in the EV guys. and it won't be priced at just 2000 though fast forward times now there is a monopoly in the moped market by TVS right now with XL100 being the only IC moped in the country it sells around 30k to 40k units per month kinetic group is not planning to revive luna as a 50 cc engine instead luna is set to be an electric vehicle i've always said this the trick is to go electric now There are a lot of electric scooters springing up regularly that are solely targeted to the B2B sector. Even Honda is in the line to launch EVs for the B2B sector. A recent patent of an electric moped has surfaced and the Benly e-test mules are getting prevalent as well. Now is the time for the Kinetic Group to revive its iconic Luna moped in India. 2023 Luna moped will be manufactured by Kinetic Green Energy and Power Solutions, a sister brand of the Kinetic Group. Kinetic Engineering Limited has commenced production of chassis and sub assemblies as well. Now Kinetic is setting a separate assembly line for the Luna Electric at production capacity of 5k units per month. So wait, what's to expect? For 2023 Luna Electric, Kinetic seems to be the big bet. Now technical specs are not known yet. That said, Kinetic is sure to play the affordability card and design the product accordingly. This should definitely appeal to the target audience. Maybe you, a relatively small and purposeful moped with a range of about 70 km should suffice. Kinetic Green Energy and Power Solutions intends to launch the Kinetic Luna EV soon in India. As per some recent news, Kinetic Energy Limited has started the production of major chassis components for the upcoming Luna EV. The company has installed 30 new welding machines in its new assembly line. that is kept exclusively for the upcoming luna even the paint shop the fabrication shops all of that has been upgraded at the company's manufacturing plant in amnagar the future electric luna will provide all that the market requires especially as ev is continuing to grow in our country as an all electric last mile transportation medium the electric luna would be aimed at clients in the low tier market and the load carrier category now While KEL has given us a general sense of what its first electric scooter will look like, it has not divulged any specifics like engine specs, battery pack size, pricing, nothing. There is no word on when the electric Luna will be available for purchase. So I guess all we can do is wait and watch. The E2 wheeler segment in India has been growing at a fast pace on the back of government subsidies, high fuel prices. Nearly 2 lakh 50,000 units were sold in financial year 2022. It is expected to grow 7 lakh units by the end of financial year 2023. And this quote was said by Nagesh A Basavan Hali, the executive vice chairman of Greaves Scott. Now Kinetic Green has made an initial investment of over 50 crore rupees in its two wheeler business. And there are plans to invest more than 400 crores in the next years. So well, this seems like the right time to channel my inner Sharo can say दिल थाम के बैठी है दोस्तों क्योंकि पिक्चर अभी बाकी है द काइनेटिक लूना इलेक्ट्रिक शाइन इज अ ग्रेट एग्जाम्पल ऑफ कीपिंग अप विद टाइम आई कॉन्ट वेट टू गेट माई हैंड्स इन दिस ब्यूटी और आई योर थॉट्स ऑन द सेम डू शेयर थॉट्स एंड कीप वॉचिंग द स्पेस फॉर मोर सच कॉन्टेंट